Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel and uh, Microsoft been talking about sleeping tabs on Edge and actually sleeping tabs is a feature where tabs that are not open that are open sorry but have not been actually used for a certain time will kind of go to sleep leaving uh, more uh, resources for the rest of what you're doing and they kind of you know, will remove some of the key ingredients of RAM memory, stuff like that. Uh, sleeping tabs is a, a neat feature, honestly. And it is something that is turned on by default in Windows, but you can actually customize it. So sleeping tabs, according to what they say, has actually saved more than um, 200, um, as they're saying, 273, sorry, petabytes of RAM in 28 days of testing. So this is according to their own um, savings of performance. Now, um, sleeping tabs are great if you're using Edge and that you have a laptop or a tablet and that is always running on battery. They will, of course, minimize the consumption of power. So for sleeping tabs, to have all the details, make sure that they are on and they are set to what you want. Go into Edge, go into the upper right corner in the three dots, go into the settings. Here you will go down to what is system and performance. You click here and down here you will see that there is an option for turn on efficiency mode. There's going to be save resources with sleeping tabs. This is what you want to turn on. Uh, you'll have fade sleeping tabs. What that means is that a sleeping tab will actually fade off and will be less visible in the different tabs that you have open. Of course, you can actually put inactive tabs to sleep after a special amount of time, specified amount of time. So you can click here. It could be 30 seconds up to an hour activity. It could be 15 minutes, for example, here. So what happens is that the tabs are actually going to stop using resources. They're going to also be removed from RAM memory temporarily. Um, on average, on a PC, they say that most of the Edge uh, sleeping tabs have saved at least 40 megabytes of RAM. Sounds very little, but it could make a difference on machines, especially that have lower RAM. And it depends on the amount of tabs that you open. Of course, the more tabs that are open, the more resources these tabs are going to actually uh, be using. And so by having, you know, uh, inactivity, if I put it here 30 seconds and I, I just stay here, what happens is these tabs, these three other tabs that are open right now should actually go to sleep after 30 seconds of inactivity. And there should be a visible um, amount of, of, you know, uh, something on the tabs themselves at the top should be visible actually. So it's a great feature. It's nice because it does improve CPU performance by actually stopping what the other tabs are doing. It also improves battery life and will save you some RAM at some point. If you have a lot of tabs open, there are people that use tabs like crazy. And what happens is these tabs will actually be, um, you know, there's going to be like 10, 12, 15 tabs open by just knowing which tabs you're using all the time, it's going to keep active only the ones that are very active. Sometimes we have tabs that we leave in the background and we just don't use. And now you see here at the top, the new tab, the two new tabs here at the top, you could see an icon. And this is saying this tab is sleeping to save resources. And it's actually giving you an estimate of savings of the resources. So it says here 11%, the other one also 11%. So by having sleeping tabs, you can save resources and just set it to how many time of act inactivity you want. Um, typically, I probably would put like ten, five or 10 minutes. And a laptop on battery, uh, 30 seconds, could be a very, very good idea. So great little feature on a um, on the, in the Microsoft Edge browser to extend battery life, save resources, and make sure your computer runs smoothly. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us a thumbs up. Thank you for watching.